Well guys, currently waiting on a bus, a bus to Porta Princesa. It's taking a long time really, so I've just spotted this wee drinks place across the street from the bus stop. And I'm quite thirsty, so I'm gonna see what they are and maybe get one. Hi there, man. Can you tell me please what all these are? Our train? Uh, this one? I don't know, is it Gulaman maybe? Gulaman. I've seen it before, yeah. And then, we know, but what is this one too? Pineapple. Is pineapple, is this coconut? Boko, coconut. Boko, okay. And then this melon. one, melon. Yeah. Uh, I'll try the black gula man, please, yeah. Yeah, we were right to do that to begin with. <laughs> Let's see, how much is it? Uh, 40, 40 only. Okay. I think that's 30 there. Let's see. <laughs> Guys, I've got it. Maybe do I get, was that enough, was it? Yeah, yeah, okay. All right, sell them up, sell them up. Our way back over to see Anne and see, okay, see you later. Let's give it a wee cross. Happy days, yeah, I'm gonna try and see what it's actually like. It is so sweet, you can taste like, I don't know, condensed milk in it or something. Here's Anne, here, try it out. Good man. You not like? My one cousin. Your one cousin, okay. No, it's really, really good, but. Mm. This should keep me going until the bus comes. It should be, I don't know, 20 minutes maybe? Yeah. Hopefully. Uh, 15 minutes. 15, 20. Yeah, soon anyway, guys. There are upper people waiting here, which is a good sign. So we'll get on the bus and I will see you there. Guys, we've made it onto the bus, but look, for like stopping and like loading loads of stuff on inside. There's like meat or whatever there. And then some big massive box and stuff is getting like, like put inside so yeah i don't know how many stops like this we're gonna have to do but yeah pretty good it's actually quite warm on the bus for aircon there is like it looks like there is but there isn't if you know what i mean but once we get moving the wind is coming in through these nice windows which is nice eating shumai from earlier it's actually still warm i don't know how that is this shumai is like crisp on the outside too which is different from what we usually get you're eating away, dipping in. See, it's like crispy. <laughs> oh, try it. Good? Yeah, muscle around. Guys, it's coming off. We've literally just got, I don't know, five minutes down the road and we're getting this whole big box off too again. But yeah, so far so good. It is because it gets moving. The box isn't moving off, it's just the people that are moving off. That had the box. Anyway, I don't know. On the move again, guys. See you there. Or see you somewhere. Guys, we get our tickets afterwards, so we're nearly there. Maybe about halfway there, would you say? Roughly anyway, but this guy's like clipping our tickets over there. He works on the bus. And we give him 200, but how much yeah, is it? 200. But how much is it? 100 for him. 100. Oh, really? Is it? Okay, sell him out, sell him out. And then here's our tickets there, guys. So yeah, he's just stamped them all. I don't know what that means, but obviously he does anyway. Uh, yeah, 100 each. That's not much of a saving. It was 130 each for the like upper um, one, wasn't it? So, but there you go anyway. So the bus is, what, 30 pesos cheaper than if you got the multi-cab or the air-conditioned one. Guys, we have stopped at this roadside place and we're doing something that I've never heard of, but we're gonna try it. It looks like a souffle, actually. It's like a muffin or something, yeah. That's what it looks like. And yeah, I'll try one, yeah, yeah, sure. What is it? Is it like cheese or something? It's like in this like oven underneath where there's fire going on. And this is all the prepared, ready done ones. We're literally, there's the bus right there, obviously, so I don't know how long it's gonna stop. The heat is roasting from this. But you've obviously tried it before, Anz, considering that you're like, you know, interested in getting one. Well, yeah. Give me 40. 20? Oh, 20 to here, hold. Hold. Uh, Smoke like there's us paid up guys. We've got two. We've got two, one each. Happy days, happy days. That's a good wee snack for the bus. This is like a cool wee stop that we've made. There's like a, a machete here too. <laughs> they must make like like buku juice or something as well, which is cool. But I think that's us ready anyway. Hey dog. Alright. Yeah, we ready? Get no change. Just wait. Okay. Just gotta wait for our change then guys and then back on the bus we go and eat this. Is this your favourite snack? 
in the whole wide world. <laughs> what? 10 pesos? What? 10 pesos. No. Well. I don't, sorry, no. Okay. Sort of. Oh my goodness, there's a goat in here, guys. What the heck? There's a goat in the bus this whole time, I have no idea. Hey, goat. <laughs> How random is that? A goat in the bus. Right, anyway, so now we know there's a goat in the bus and we've got our treat. What's it called again? Bibinka. Bibinka? Fair enough. Like, well, music, guys, but we'll eat our bibinka. Ah, uh, okay, we've got to get the crispy ends off then, guys. It looks like a muffin. Oh, it's still, oh, it's lovely and warm. It's perfect, if you know what I mean. Hopefully it tastes good. I wonder what it's like. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's got that nice crisp to it, which is great. Well, the burnt bit doesn't taste that good, but once you get past the upper bit and into the middle, it's very soft and delicate, as you can see. It very much does remind me of a muffin. If this had blueberries in it, it would be so good. Like, it would be even better, if you know what I mean or even chocolate or something, but there's also coconut in it, which is what you would expect, like everything has got coconut. Any dessert I've tried here has got coconut in it, pretty much most do. I'd, I'd say about 90%. <laughs> what have you got in yours? What do you think of yours? Tastes good, compared to other ones you've had. Pretty good. Not bad. Well, we'll get these head up, we'll get back in the move. How close? Um, how close do you think we are to, like, Erewhon? 20 minutes. 20? That's not too bad, that's not too bad. 20 minutes, this should keep us going, and then we've got to get another trike, or a, uh, not a trike, a multi-cab, multi-cab, yeah. And then it's like a seven minute walk. Then we're going to the Go Hotel in Porta Princesa, and we'll give you a wee show of that room. I've never stayed at a Go Hotel before, so it did look good in the pictures, but obviously we'll do an in-depth review once we get there too. Guys, so currently on our way towards Robinson's and this is the most packed I've ever been on a multi-cop or a jeepney. Like, just look at it. It's just like everyone. We're all sitting here, like, just completely squished in. It's quite small too. My head isn't hitting it and whenever I go forward, it hits the bar. Like, uh, but you said it's 20 minutes. It's going to take something like that. Roughly anyway. Hopefully it doesn't take too much longer than the 20 minutes. But yeah, on our way, get to the hotel soon and we will do that tour that I promised earlier. Oh my goodness, I'm so happy to be off that multi-cab. It was so packed and the journey felt like it took forever. But we're now near Robinson's Mall in some random gas station actually. But yeah, I think our hotel is kind of close. We might have to look at the maps to find out exactly where, but I'm pretty sure it's only about maybe five, ten minutes at the most walk away. No point in getting a trike after that. So, see you there soon guys, my goodness. Well guys, just arrived here. It's nice to actually be in a, in a built up room with like a TV, things like that. The room, it's pretty standard. I think it was 19 pounds, 1450 pesos, maybe something like that. As you can see, it looks like it should be comfortable anyway, but obviously the bed test will be the main thing. The last mattress was quite comfortable, but the pillows weren't that comfortable. So let's see. Okay, yeah, nice and bouncy. It does creak and make a bit of noise though, but how are the pillows? Pillows, I'm not very happy with the pillows actually. That's kind of annoying, but hopefully I sleep well anyway. They're like these weird pillows, which like, I don't know, they're just not very comfortable. But they do have a quiet aircon. That's like a modern aircon with like the, you know, just the modern one, the Samsung one, which is good. A nice big mirror here, just to make the room feel a bit bigger. TV, obviously I've already mentioned, but let's go into the bathroom. The bathroom is quite nice. I think it's the main reason that I did book the place. It's got, well, I'll keep that open for now for the light. Obviously tiles, the amenities, and I sort of like, I don't know if that's marble, but it's, it's nice anyway. Water pressure, pretty good, pretty good. It does come with the dental kits. So it's like, it's like a budget, but slightly like a premium budget hotel, if that makes sense. Um, so, you know, it's just, it's good, but not like great. If you spend an extra five pounds or maybe, I don't know, three, 100 pesos that would maybe work out up. You're gonna get a lot more for your money. Like, I mean, I've actually secured that Sunlight Hotel for the same price as this one, and it's got the pay view, so it's just nuts. You've gotta really try. Sure, man, I'm disappointed in that. It didn't show that. That's very, very low. I don't even think, I don't, I don't even think Alan's gonna be able to fit underneath that. I'm gonna have to hold that up. That's pretty annoying, actually. That's like part of the reason I booked the hotel. Does the pressure suit, let's see. Oh. Right guys, I just soaked myself. I'm not annoyed anymore, but I'm, I'm annoyed a wee bit. 
There's a, there's a rain shower above me, right? What do you see? I just turned that on and then this came on. <laughs> oh no, no, I'm trapped. I can't get back in. Shit, what am I meant to do? Right, there. Okay, the shower is good, right? I'm happy again, I'm happy again. That is good, okay, let's see. That was so disguised, it didn't like come down. It's built into the actual roof, so yeah. I'm kind of happy that happened anyway. Well, it's nearly built into the roof, can you see that? It was disguised anyway. B-Day, B-Day, is it good? Whitney, that's powerful. Yeah, things are starting to look up for this hotel, actually. Tiles, yeah, they're not too crispy. They use a bit of fabric softener then, that's decent. Oh, did they have shampoo? They do have shampoo, but it comes in this sort of thing. So it's shampoo, conditioner, and body wash. It's pretty much just body wash, to be honest then. But I'm glad it's a rain shower. So bathroom. Oh, does the toilet flush do? Okay, let's see. Let it go. Yeah, I can just do that and let it go, so that's great. Yeah, yeah, a bit better than I thought then. Not too bad. It depends what we're gonna have on the TV channels. Do they have satellite? I don't know. Can I plug my fire stick into it? I don't think so, guys. Let's see. Oh, actually, I do see a port. Something I would thoroughly recommend if you're ever traveling, bring your fire stick with you. It means you get Netflix, Amazon, whatever you're subscribed to. And I'm soaked. I'm absolutely soaked. Do you see that? The shower is hidden and it just went all over me. I was like complaining about that is so low. And I turned it on and then all of a sudden it just pours all over me. I think you need to take a shower. Yeah, I know. I think That's I will so take a shower. Guys, the view is to die for. Breathtaking. Three, two, one. What do you think of that? No, it's not that great, is it? But we are right beside Robinson's, which is good. So it's good for getting food, good location. We are just traveling to Port Barton tomorrow. Hence why we're here. If we were staying here and this was our hotel for the next three or four days and my budget permitted it, I would probably rent out a bike. I like the fact it's got a wee coat hanger here actually too. That's not too bad. And then like a bug sapper behind me. But that's pretty much it for now. I might see you soon, I might not. But until then, see you later.